What's up, NZers? Hi! And welcome back to the next episode in the series where we try some of your classic American food. And today on the menu is the classic American hot dog. So we're pretty excited to try this one. Uh, we actually have a version of the hot dog here in New Zealand, but it's not called a hot dog. It's actually called, I, I, we, it's like a sausage sizzle, or like a pig in a blanket, like what, like, I don't know. There's no real like official name for it. It's just like you go to the sausage sizzle and you get a sausage on bread. And we'll show it. you it, actually. We'll, we'll show you when we get to the table. Yeah. But anyway, we've got Nadine on the onions. Yeah. How are your eyes? They're fine so far, but apparently you guys like your raw onion. When we have onion here, we always slice it and then fry it. And then cook it. Yeah, yeah. but you guys have raw onion. Yeah. And I used to think, far oh, out, that's not going to taste very nice. But <laughs> I think we had it on the Atlanta's Kitchen episode. Yes. And it was actually really good. Yeah, yeah, we've, so, we've, yeah, we've, we've tried it on a few different things now. Yeah. Just, but it has to be like diced real fine. Really, really fine. Yeah, and just sprinkled on top. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we had it also on the uh, halftime Super Bowl show on the Skyline Chili. Oh, maybe that's what I'm thinking about. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. We had it there. Lanta, what are you up to? I'm frying the sausage for our sausage sizzle. Frying the sausage over here? Oh, because we're going to show you our sausage sizzle. So this is Atlanta station. So that's the lone, the lone sausage that we've got there to cook for our sausage sizzle. So show you what that's like. And Gen Z, what are you doing over here, mate? I'm just making sure the pickles are in check. <laughs> The pickle checker. How are they going? Are they usable? Did they pass? Nice. Pretty good. All right, the pickles have been certified by Denzel. Mm -hmm. So what we've got is we have got the basic ingredients that we needed for a an American, a classic American hot dog. Now we, on our research, we went through online and we found that there as there is actually a crazy amount of different hot dogs that you guys have over there. And it seems like every city has its own unique style of making a classic hot dog. So we're just going for the really basic one. So we've just got, we found these. We found the brand that actually sells proper American hot dogs. So they look really nice, nice long ones. And then you've got the long uh, hot dog bun. So we've got them, but just basic bread roll. We've got mild American mustard and we've got some tomato ketchup. We call it tomato sauce. You guys call it ketchup. I don't know if they're different. Are they different? I don't know, but I couldn't find any ketchup later, oh. so. And we've got the pickles, jar of pickles, we just thought. So, uh, and we've also got the raw onions, obviously. Yeah. So when we show you our classic uh, kiwi uh, sausage sizzle, you'll see that uh, there's a, a few things that are the same, but different. And we'll show you that when we get to the table. But anyway, we're gonna start cooking the sausages, slicing the buns, slicing the pickles. So lovely this, is, getting. this is the classic New Zealand type of sausage that we have. And we pretty much never, we never really have anything like this at all, eh? No. You can get them there, obviously, but we're, they're just not like a very popular. Well, we get Frankfurt's. Yeah, you get Frankfurt's, but even that's not that popular. Yeah. Like this is like the number one type of sausage that we get here. And it's usually done with like venison or lamb or pork. With like, or um, yeah, or beef. So these are the American hot dogs. Welcome back to the table guys. Pull up a chair and come and join us as we try this classic American food for the first time ever. So we're really excited about this one. I don't know why, but why do I always feel like these dishes have something to do with camping? Like why do they just feel like they suit camping yeah. so much? Everything that we've tried, the s'mores, the sloppy joes, the peanut butter and jelly. Yeah. Like I just feel like that you just like have it, you want to go camping in America and you just want to take all these. I feel like they're just really easy meals. Yeah, really easy and to like, make. Like this for us. Yeah. When we go camping or when we have some sort of a like event yeah. and you just want to feed everyone real like quickly, cheaply, yeah. real easy. It's like guys on the barbecue, you do the sausage, you have bread and that's it. You get a loaf of bread and a bag of sausages yeah. and you're sorted. Yeah, I feel like this is, this is definitely a step up from yeah. that, but yeah. it's just like a quick, easy way to feed a lot of people. Yeah, so basically our classic kiwi one is just made up of a single piece of white bread, then you put loads of butter on it, 
chuck the sausage on, and then you put heaps of your cooked onion, your fried onion all over it. Like heaps. Yeah, heaps of onion. And then it's really, although mustard isn't that popular here in New Zealand, a few people still do get it. Yep. So they get the mustard and uh, tomato sauce. But tomato sauce is like, by far and away. Oh, it's non-negotiable. The most, like, you just can't even beat it here in New Zealand. In fact, what do they say about the, uh, you're not a Kiwi unless you love our Wadi's sauce. Yeah, and also, some people just have tomato sauce sandwiches. Just tomato sauce. I can't believe we don't have ketchup chips here. When we love tomato sauce I so know, much. I know. We need to have tomato sauce chips. It even weird. says on the thing, NZ's favourite tomato sauce. There you go. There it is. We love our Wadi sauce. Yeah, we do. Alright, and we have also, in these episodes, you guys know that we always have a guest appearance by a drink that we try and track down. Something that might be completely, you know, that's unique to you guys. Yeah. Or your part of the world. And isn't very common or popular here. And we've never tried before. Yeah. So today's drink is... That looks good. So vanilla float. So I'm guessing this is like a, a root beer float. Yeah. With vanilla flavored ice cream. Okay. Flavored Dr Pepper. Dr. Wow, Pepper that's. Woo, that's gonna be like. Yeah, Dr Pepper float. True. I know. Yeah. Oh wow. So it's like a. Okay, so it might have nothing to do with root beer then. Oh. So it might just be a uh, float. You know how you could you a float? You can just put ice cream in any drink. Yeah. Yeah. yeah so it'll be Dr Pepper and vanilla ice cream. Okay. So first thing is grab your sausage. Okay. There you go. I mean, you're a hot dog, not sausage. Grab your hot dog. Hot dog. That's a hot dog. Yeah. Do they? And, and also, you guys just call them dogs. Yeah. Yeah, just dogs. Just dogs. And okay, now grab a, um, a sprinkle of onion. Kyle, okay. Finally, chop the raw onion. There you go. Okay. Never had raw onion. On a dog. Oh, okay. I can't, I can't yeah. wait. I'm just going a couple for it. spears of just pickle. I liked it last time, so I'm thinking that I will like it this time. Yeah. Like how much raw onion do we put just on? Just like that. Just coat it. Coat it. Okay. Yeah. I'm just putting how it. How much have you got? Yeah. I've got that. Okay. Dizzy, I'm Tracking? interested. Yeah, I'm interested with you, buddy, because he doesn't love onion. Yeah. Lenta, did you do onion? I uh, said, yeah, onion and pickle. Okay. Pickle. Yeah. Okay. Pickle. 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 Yeah. Pickle. 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 A little bit of pickle. Loves the pickle. This pickle. guy. Pickles. So how much pickle did you put on? I put in three spares. Three spares, okay. Oh, wow. I'll go for three. Love me some yummy pickles. You mean love me some? It's all oh, about yeah. it's all about the wiggle apparently mm -hmm. with the okay. sauce. It's all so about gotta... the wiggle. <laughs> it's hard to squeeze. It's the wiggle. Oh, that looks good. <laughs> okay, go. hold on. Oh, I'm excited. I it's hard to squeeze in, so. I've got my wig along. Okay, okay yeah. who's ready? Yeah. All right, classic American hot dog time, everyone. Let's go. Bash, Bash it. Bash it. Bash it. Smash, Smash it. Smash it. I just got, I just got taken to like a state fair or like a rodeo or something. Walking around to one of the stands and get grabbing a hot dog. That's good. That's, yeah, that's that's, that feels like what it would be like. It's like state fair food. The pickles though, eh? Yeah. Wow. So good. It just elevates the flavour. Yeah. Don't you think? Mm-hmm. Wow. What do you reckon, Deb? That's you... good. I feel like I just went to a place in Texas. Like... <laughs> <laughs> nice. Hey, Dens, and how are you feeling about the onion? Can you can you dig it? I'm not up to the onion bit. Oh, okay. Well, let me know. <laughs> I'm really interested how he does with the onion. Lanta, what about your onion? Oh, it's so good. Mm. It's, it's really it's just, good. It's subtle, but it gives a lot of flavor. Yeah. Yeah, love it. It's time to try the Dr. Pepper vanilla float. Let's go. All right, Here dink we go. it. Dink, dink it. it. Sink it. Sink it. Wow. Oh, wow. The that Dr. Is Pepper good. flavor is a lot subtle. That, wow, yeah. That's better than normal Dr. Pepper. Really? Or, yeah. or Dr. Pepper is growing on us. Mm. Because apparently it is an acquired taste for those that don't drink it regularly. I'm yeah. starting to like it. I feel like with the vanilla Coke, that vanilla makes the flavor of whatever drink you're drinking like less strong. Like it, yeah. it brings everything down. Maybe that's what this has done. Yeah, it likes, yeah, I don't know. It kind of evens everything out. She's back into the oh, dog. Back in, yeah, me too. She's Let's go. back into Dang. the dog. Oh. Oh. How did we get so comfortable eating like this on camera? <laughs> <laughs> That's my question. All over our face. Like all over. <laughs> 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 this guy. Oh, oh onion. onion. Is it good? You don't like the onion? It's not strong. But yeah, I think it's really nice with just a tiny I little piece of onion. I think it just gives it like a pickling. <laughs> 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 you 
You're all right, mate. Okay, you can when you eat your it. hot dog, your American hot dog, do you bite from both ends or do you just chew one end through? Mm. Like, how do you guys go about it? When I'm eating that, I'm a both end chewer. You're a both end chewer? Yeah. Okay, okay. Because yeah. I was just contemplating going from the other side. I'm one eater. One, one end, okay. Really? One. You know why I go... One she's end just end. a polish it offer. <laughs> Yeah, she's a, she's a foodie. She's Loves a, a food. Magician makes uh -huh. it disappear. Uh huh. I always bite from both ends because the sauce always ends up dripping out one end. So mm. then I catch it all and then I go for the other side. Mm. Any thoughts or just eating? <laughs> <laughs> just like our other things, like um, s'mores and like sloppy joes and stuff like that. You always say, basically, after we've uploaded the video, your comments always say. Oh, you should have had this or should have had that with that snack. Yeah. What do you guys have with a hot dog? Is it just a hot dog? Like, I feel like they go to like a baseball game or something. A milkshake. I reckon it's a milkshake. Is it a milkshake I'm and a hot dog? It. I'm calling oh, it. I reckon really? it's french fries. Could be. Oh, could, could be, be chips. fries. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, I don't know. I'm going, I'm going to go with milkshake. You're going to stay with milkshake? Yeah. I reckon it's a bear and a hot dog. Oh, yeah. If I, you're reckon, a, I reckon it's a bear. Yeah. yeah. If you're a, one of those guys. But, um... <laughs> <laughs> you, you mean you mean old enough? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Beer and hot dog eating competitions. They have hot dog eating competitions. We won. We won this hot dog yeah. eating competition. Atlanta won. Now it's time to win this. <laughs> oh what? Chugging contest? Yeah. Got too fizzy. She uh... <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness. Where are your manners, Denzel? <laughs> You've got so, like a, a mustard moustache. <gasps> moustache! Oh yeah, mustard. <laughs> <laughs> mustard. Shh. Okay, <laughs> mustard. It's a mustard. Do you want to lick it off or not? A mustard. No, I'm good. I'll soak it. And it's time to rate the Dr. Pepper Vanilla Float Soda. Yes. Okay, ready, set, go. Yes! I love it! Yes! Oh, Wait, good. I love it. Did you forget to put one up? Okay, quickly go. Quickly Check it out. Go. There we Yay! go. Nice. Yeah, nice. What about our little meow 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 meow? No, that's only if we all have a toe up, at least one toe up. Oh, that's, is it only for toe? Yeah, that's for special. You can't only. put toes no. up afterwards. We no. just want the hype button. <laughs> yeah, they just want the hype button. Toes, okay. Toes, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Next up, American hot dog. Let's, let's rate it. Let's rate it. Let's do it. Okay. Okay. One, two, three. Yeah. Two, to two, two, two thumbs toes. up and two toes up. <laughs> two thumbs, two toes up. Yeah. <laughs> I got two toes. <laughs> no, that was really good. So that was another amazing classic American food. Oh, I nearly said snack. Okay. I nearly said snack. Okay, can I just say something? Please. Sure. Okay, thanks. So what I've noticed is that when we started to do some research on American hot dogs, we realized how elaborate you guys actually make these mm. and how many different things that you stack on top and yeah. how many different like ways and flavors even ones with like chili yeah well i was going to say we have some episodes coming up in this series to do with hot dogs as well we're going to do chili dogs and corn dogs yeah so we'll show you so there's chili two dogs exactly guess what exactly. what are chili dogs what are corn dogs i also saw they put mac and cheese in the american hot dogs what? what? Mac and cheese in See, you you guys get crazy. You get crazy. We, we decided to do one that was like super basic. Yeah. But Ooh. more but, but more involved. Super classic, like old yeah. old fashioned American hot dog. And as always, guys, thank you for joining us in our dining room yes. as we have this unique experience trying your amazing food, your classic. Lots more to come. Yes, we've got heaps more episodes planned. Yeah, we do. So and if you've got an idea, do let us know what else we could try. That's yes. a classic American yeah. food. Yeah. Like not a state food, because if you're following us, you'll know that Atlanta's got a, her own series. Go and check it out. Yeah. Atlanta's Kitchen, cooking and trying um, each state's food. Yeah. But a classic American food, that's what we do here. All right. And if you liked this one, make sure you... Destroy. Smash like button. Like, like button. Like button. Make sure you smash the subscribe button, and we be... Smash! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and also, make sure you hit the bell so you don't miss any future uploads. Yeah. And also... 
comment down below as to what your favorite way to do your hot dog is. Yep. What's your favorite toppings and fillings and everything yep. like that. Tell us your most wild ideas yeah, for the us, American hot dog. Let us know how crazy you guys get. Yeah. This is already kind of wild with like the raw onion. This is wild for him. It's wild yeah. for us. <laughs> But that was, I think this was a good little introduction. I it think was. this is a good, this just opened the gate. I it mean, did. this is the gateway dog. It it? Yeah. The gateway dog. Yeah. So now we're, now we're, out, the whole world of hot dogs is open up to it us is. now and we're going to explore it. Yeah. And we're so going to go crazy. Give us your ideas. But anyway, guys, <laughs> we love you guys and we'll see you in the next one. Bye! Bye.